So there, folks, welcome back to Town to Shine and Valerius. We Hello, everyone. We immediately <laughs> reaches for the pens at the moment I start the countdown. Well done, Bill. Brilliant. I can't help it. I'm so, such a thirsty so boy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm basically a camel with the amount of liquids I drink. You do look a bit like a camel. You've got a hump. <laughs> Lovely lady lumps. I beg your pardon. <laughs> uh, right, so plan is... Oh my god, that looks really weird. I was just noticing that bird flapping around, but it looks like the dead chicken behind it was flapping around. Oh yeah, I just noticed it looks exactly like Flappy Bird. Maybe we could flappy, make a game out of this. Flappy chicken. <laughs> yeah. Flappy Fla- dirt. Dead flappy chicken. So, um, first off, Craig Gummersall says, when we're in the dungeon, we can smell. we at least try and follow the heroes and see what they're doing rather than just staring at empty rooms? No, we, we so cannot that's do this. Something. But we were gonna, we were gonna open the doors, weren't we? We were? We were going to open the doors and go get the hall in taken care of. But I thought everyone was still fighting down there. It is, but it's almost it's almost clear. I and think you should have followed the heroes around. We did say oh, last episode whistled. that we would have a look. We'll, f- we'll have a look at these guys for a minute. But then we'll, we'll, we'll fuck these guys for the minute. We'll get the hall in done. So and, we can think and about all we'll the next Because th- I don't think there's enough monsters left to pose any significant danger. Sorry about that. Burp in the mouth. Please, please, no buts. Yes, well, I didn't do um, it out loud, did I? So we could also, I mean... I'm being gentlemanly about it. Yeah. If we open the doors first and let them haul up the shit, and then we can sort out the goblin heads. There's some hobgoblin boots down here, not those. Actual hobgoblinite boots. In the past, was there we ever just a time... Got a siege. Was there ever a time in the past where it was, like, normal to let out flatulence and, like, uh, not be seen as rude? I'd imagine so. Oh. Should probably uh, turn everyone to soldiers. Yeah. Yeah. Let us... Let us pray. <laughs> some people say it's like a compliment to uh, release gas after having a meal. Yes. So the chef knows that you enjoyed their meal. Yeah, because that's easier than saying, mm, that was nice. <laughs> <laughs> so we have ways and means of doing that already. Mm, that was a very nice meal. I would like to partake in another at some point in this timeline. There must be a simpler way of me getting this across. <laughs> 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 That's how much I enjoyed your meal. <laughs> you can smell my enjoyment across the room. I gave this meal burp, one burp out of five. <laughs> Brilliant. That could be a whole um, new rating system. This is quite a lacklustre siege. They're just sort of milling around. Like, hmm, should we go in? You go first, Bob. Okay, I'll, I'll go first. I'm, I'm not scared. I'm not scared, really. I'm coming back. <laughs> I'm <Hello. scared. laughs> I'm thinking so much about Banish now. I'm watching this. <laughs> they're, just, they're not even. There's two slimes that are like <laughs> they're patrolling. Oh, here we go. Here we go. The wall's like fuck this. <laughs> fuck I'm this going in. Cover me. Oh no! Someone see me. He's, he's Leroy. Go, go get hilarious. the chicken. Go Leroy! get the chicken. Straight for all Rick. Straight for all Rick. Oh no! He smells of beef. He's the only one that's been surrounded by oh, David. Yeah. Look at all these. Oh guys. shit! The slimes. The slimes. That is a lot of slimes. Yeah, uh, they're on Necromancer Valley. Then I'm yeah, that's a dangerous. Oh, the head crusher with Alphalos. That's a dangerous place to make your first sort of foray into Derbsville, oh, straight yeah. into the Necromancy row. Especially when uh, you know they use your bones for Gartners and all that. Gartners, Gartners. Oh Gartners. no! Oh, Donald Dargis died in the melee. Holy shit! What? It, it was all going so well. How did he die? And then Donald was somehow stabbed up the bum by Alphalos, with no one watching. Yep, it was a secret mercy killing. Oh my god, where are they all going? There's a pink slime right there, coming after all of them. It's okay, Sam will put a van on on the ball. So, uh, just to remind everyone, who was Donald? Donald Dargis. Um, He was... That guy? He was one of the necromancers, Ah. I'm pretty sure. Oh, maybe it's all part of a cunning plan of his rite of passage into the necromancy way. Yeah, he's been around quite a while. He was probably like one of the second or third wave of immigrants. Or maybe people just... Second immigrants thing. He looked a bit like Arthur. Maybe people just didn't like him, right? And they were like, Donald, if you can kill a slime while naked, covered in butter, (laughs) we'll we'll allow you to be part of the necromancy crew. (laughs) And it was like, no... That was really fucking weird. Uh, you should probably turn everyone back so you're now letting them idle when we get to oh, an yeah. offer that. Um, um, I mean, and the yeah, equipment's pretty decent. I'm quite surprised that he couldn't survive that. Well, he, I think he might have been one of the people with the least good equipment. Though. He I don't was, think he one, was of one of the people the, who was still wearing wooden pants. One of the pro league guys. He was wearing his wooden pants, his wooden hat. It's like a wooden well, hat. He I definitely mean, wasn't wearing wood. He might have been wearing mixed spider right and goblin eyes. He was wearing mud pants, wooden hat. And a red hat. And, uh, yeah, the red hat was so, made out of uh, it. Was well, just painted on the one hand, that means we now have a, a new necromancer room. slot. Yay! 
We have a few spare rooms. Oh my god, oh. Tia just died! Wow. Holy shit. Oh my fucking god. That elf's dead. And it's another ghost room situation. Oh yeah, and the it other is problem... miles away. Yeah, but the problem is now is the oh, fact shit, that push? no one is going to be going there. What did you push? I don't know. I don't know. I think I'll move my fingers and let them all just sit back down. <laughs> that was so weird. That was quite weird. What did you push? I don't know. What killed him then? Uh, a dying wolf alpha, I think. Wow. Which is, you mean I that think, thing that's ass? what killed the other thing. Um, isn't that what Alfrost died to? Oh, no, it was a hobgob hobgoblin. Wow. That burned him. Got all that damage. Yeah, the Dive Wolf was knocking off a lot of damage there, though, up the top. Look, 480, 480, 480. Dive Wolf bit him for 480, Dive Wolf bit him for 480. Yeah. But it looks like the hobgoblin did the vast majority of the damage there, and the cave troll. If you scroll up, you'll see more Dive Wolves. There we go, who's in there? Ulrich. Ulrich Demutia. You're going to be talking through this silence, Sharon. Sorry, I was trying to like, um... You can't even drink while this is going on. The Die Wolf Alpha was there, it's just died now. Admittedly, I should have brought a glass. There's the Hobgoblin Kaiser. I don't see the Cave Troll. Oh, that's there. It's dead. Also, I wonder right. if the Cave Troll sort of softened him up and the others finished him off. Something that's rather interesting. That was our best hero, though. You know you don't put magnets on computers? Yeah. Right. Why did they invent magnetised screwdrivers that can go inside computers? You're not meant to use them for, like, motherboard components or stuff. Oh, right. I mean, magnetised screw screwdrivers are obviously good for, like, keeping hold of the screws and not dropping oh, them yeah. into the case, but you shouldn't you know, use them on the motherboard. The thing is, the thing about screwdrivers is, even if you get a non-magnetised screwdriver, years of using it magnetises it. Like, it picks up a faint magnetic effect from being, like, rubbed against metal so much. You could tell this is um, getting uh, ra rather interesting. Sorry, the, 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 about screwdrivers. No, I just I mean like the way you started that. You just basically went. You see, the thing about screwdrivers <laughs> is, <laughs> should we quickly grab a Tia's corpse and give him a grave? Could do before any more monsters I'd go come for that it far now, down. Though. Yeah, um, shall we give him? Since though he was our oldest hero, he's been there from the start. I think he deserves yeah. a, a tomb, a nice big tomb. Yeah, filled with um, elven goodies, such let as us, naked let us elven give him girls. A tomb. Now, was what Tia, is it? Was it's Tia, was Tia a male or a female? Do we I know? think Tia is a male name. Uh, it is a male name. It? So um, he needs a very phallic grave. Okay. Should we give him. I, I want to keep the lizard tomb for townies. Yeah. So do we want moss covered or standard? I would give Just him probably moss covered. Moss covered. To, you know, show how long he's been here. Shall we put that in a row so we'll have him two rows? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So that's going to be Tia's grave. Oh, it's so oh. You keep a flag there. The thing is, they might put them on darkest though. Oh, yeah. I'll have to... Oh, no, wait. Donald Dines didn't drop a corpse because he was on road. Yeah. Yeah, he's dead. He's gone. Oh, no, wait. What's oh, the is bones? it? Oh. No, it's just no. bones. So, yeah, it didn't drop a corpse. It would say remains if it was Wow, him. that's technically very cheaty. Well, let's have a look around, though, because it might have... They won our fault, guys. It might have dropped it somewhere nearby. So, let's just investigate, because we don't want to leave fucking remains in town. Yeah. Well, we wouldn't leave him in town. I think they'd grab that first to put in the grave. But the main problem is that obviously then you've got um, a townie having a moss covered grave. And uh, we can't blag to everyone that, you know, we've got grave settings on. I'm not seeing any remains here. So it then. Leave it. So I think he hasn't dropped a corpse, which is good, really. What I find um, um, quite interesting as well, the other day when I was in here alone, right, doing loads of like editing and such. <laughs> I um, I turned the PC off, you know, to have a look at the insides of it. Yeah. And I turned my lamp on so I could see better. Yeah. And for the first time in ages, I noticed that the lamp at the side of my PC goes Does while it? on, and I was like, oh, I never noticed that before because usually weird. all I've got is the computer sound in my ears because the computer goes on before the fan all the time. Yeah. And the fan sort of overwrites any other ambient noise. Yeah. Right, anyway. You need to play. Uh, yeah, I'm, so I'm just going to say, I'm just going to interrupt you. I'm going to play. I'm going to ignore the caravan for now. Oh, it's only a military merchant. Actually, let's just have a quick look while we're still paused. Um, in case he's got a special weapon. He hasn't. No, it's So we're really not too merchant. interested in him at the moment. Sell him one thing. Um, Sell him a bone. There's a bone in town. Yeah, but they know. might walk all the way down here and take this one. I don't You can't guarantee so. what they're going to do. That's a very low bone percentage wise. considering how many bones we have. Um... Though. What we, we could do is... Oh, we can't sell him a bone we anyway. We know those are in town. Yeah, you'd have to sell him them. 
Was it those? Are they in the blacksmith though? Because that's locked, remember? Maybe. Oh no, no, it won't be because they can't go in locked places. So it won't show you the item. There was something in town. The hobgoblin night stuff. I guess we want to sort of oh. keep. I don't think there's anything really crappy that's in town. Well, mass. Right. Massively what? crappy. Lost my store parts. There, were, there was definitely something. Somebody we swapped their equipment. It was thingy golden boots to be put on Rose. Yeah. Where did she put her old boots? Are oh, they in here? Black diorite boots. Is that them? Um, as I said, I don't think it shows you inside locked doors, and those are in locked doors. Yeah. All right. Yeah, you're right. I see your yeah. point there. So the hobgoblinite boots have to be somewhere around. So if you could find them in town. Wait, there's some, the hot some hot boots are in the dungeon. Yeah. Just sell those hot pants. Wooden Greaves. Wooden and Greaves, one level one. Let's just sell them. And the Black Bone Greaves on yeah. the three. And they're green, so we know which ones they're going to be. So, Wooden Greaves uh, and Black Bone Greaves. greaves. Uh, go up. Please say it buys hot pants. Oh, he can does, yeah. Uh, there's Bone Greaves. That's there. not the right ones. Well, Black Bone. It's like Black Beard, only Black Bone. Would Greaves level 1 attack 56? I'm sure that's them. Yeah. Yeah, that's those ones. And then... The bone ones. Black bone ones. That's the one. Level 3. We'll just sell those. How, how, how bad are those, though? Minus right. 283 attack, did that say? Uh, like, yeah. What? The colours um, affect like various stats, so they'll increase like defence but reduce attack and stuff like that. I suppose that's um, helpful if you've got like tiny hot pants I want to on. keep an eye on this now, just to see what's going on down here. I can't believe we lost Tia. And, because we've lost Donald, yeah. we've not got enough people to pull another hero in, I don't think. Well, that's quite annoying. So until then. we get somebody else, we're going to be without. Uh, and we need happiness for that. These rogues are not doing too bad, though. Yeah, well, the, the rogues problem, can flee. The problem with Tia was always going to be that as you get further and further down, if anything actually manages to cripple Tia, mm. he's in trouble, because he can't fight properly. Yeah, and he can't flee. He's got, like, a massively slower, like, attack rate as well. But he's, like, he's been with us the entire time. It's oh, a pretty yeah. hardcore... But, I mean, these rogues yeah, now hero. are really passing him, because they've got, like, the trickster and the plague bringer and all this yeah. awesome gear. I mean, he was suffering from yeah. lack of weaponry and armour. Well, like, these two are really going to, like, just mess up everything. It was pretty stupid they never coded them to take proper armour. They should be levelling really good, though, shouldn't they? Uh, I'd imagine so. What the hell is that guy doing? Oh, he just killed that thing. Yeah. It was, there was like a massive goblin just moving towards him. He was just sat there shooting it in the legs. There like, should oh, God, be a, oh, God. a townie coming to take Tia's things away. Uh, go back up and check The up. caravan is done and gone. Oh, check the townie list. See what they're doing on there. There's actually a couple of guys over there as well. Yeah. As long as it's Simon Poitou time that's coming down, we should be fine. Yeah, I mean, that'd be ideal if we could fucking nominate him to go. I'm going to have a quick look. You know, Is you're not just... going to be pausing all this time. Another caravan's on his way. You're going to be told off um, by everyone. Yeah, but I can't I can't follow them if not. I was going to tell you off. We're looking for we? someone who's making a grave. Rostate, Rostate, drop, drop, Rostate, drop off. And for Pulp Tree. Moss Cover Tomb, Tomb, Jasmine. There you go, she's just coming down now. It's always fucking Jasmine. Like, I think we should start giving Jasmine some better shit, because seriously, I seem to remember her being in quite a few of the fucking <laughs> dangerous predicaments. She just loves danger, yeah. Larry, that's, that's what it is. It's like, Jasmine, we need someone to go on a suicide mission to get us a grave. Where's uh, she gone? I can do it. She's dead already, see? She fell down, broke her leg. Where is she? Uh, you're going to have to go watch her again. <laughs> you do realise you can look in there without... She's going to bed. Down, yeah? <laughs> she's oh. going back to bed. She's changed her mind. Wow. She's going to bed. Wow. So yeah, that's yeah. Uh, holy shit, Jasmine. She fucking failure. Where's she gone? <laughs> she's gone to bed. She's in her bed. She's like, oh, this is such a nice bed. Oh, so nice. I've lost her. Thank God she's in bed though. It could get so much worse. Well, here comes the dwarven caravan. I suppose we might as well have a look at that for now. He might sell some good stuff. Dwarven X. Um, dwarven ale. Dwarven ale. That'd be pretty badass. Dwarven butter. It's not very good butter. Don't buy dwarven butter. Dwarven butter. Dwarven bread. I can't believe apparently. it's not it's really shit. Iron bars. Oh, Blessed yeah. Blessed iron breastplate. It's not that good, though. It's not that good, that though, but still. That. He's got a load of tables. He's got... Um, and we got full chairs. Tables. Oh, the chairs. We need chairs, don't we? I don't know. Let's have a look. Yeah. Yes, we do. We need one, two. We need six chairs. Yeah. So I guess we'll buy his and chairs. He's got five, so we might as well just buy all of um, his chairs. Buy his chairs. 
And then sell Spice him some shares. Shit. And then sell um, him... Do you remember all the goop as well? The storeroom's locked, so we can't mm. get that goop out of there. So this is goop that's in the dungeon. Yeah, dungeon goop. Yeah. Which, Which is, is a ideal. bit of a problem. What else can we sell him? Not a lot, to be honest. Hmm. Because that's well, selling suppose, flowers. Yeah, we've got plenty of iron and copper. We could sell some of that. Because selling flowers, that's renewable. Yeah. So he still goes with the iron. I was trying to... It's in the dungeon. The wrong way. There we go. Um, so yeah, if we're selling flowers, they're renewable anyway, and we can get enough out of him. For that. You reckon? Yeah. That's it. That's all the flowers we've got. Oh yeah, I am mean, just to get pay anything off and get rid of him. Yeah. All right. Let's Not really it. that bothered about taking his money. We've got about <sighs> 35,000 gold now, haven't we? I don't know. It's pretty ridiculous. Can we... No. no. We've it's got about, a lot. It is about 35,000. We have got a lot. So, um, right, so let's. So what we'll have to do every now and then is just harvest them flowers as well. Because well, uh, if we've reached a dead end there. If we keep the flowers harvested, we could just sell them every now and then. And they're completely renewable. Oh shit, he's going down. Oh shit. Fuck. Which hero was that? That was the other elf. See, this is what happens when you watch the heroes. They get all yeah. shy and embarrassed and miss. But now and there's and a die. fucking corpse there. Yep, inside a load of people. Who was it? Which person? Ang Angier, the new elf that we had. Oh, right. Well, there you go. Fucking elves. Oh, we got a new hero. We got a new hero. We got a new hero. It's. The barbarian. Oh, fucking barbarian. He's not going to last five seconds down there. He's going to get his ass handed to him. He's already bruised. He's only just fucking. He's spawned. already bruised. He's wrapping a bear rug around his middle <sighs> waist. We never put them bear rugs in the uh, thing, did we? Oh, yeah, you can't put them you down, can't, can you? Yeah, that was the problem. You couldn't place them. So Jasmine's about to go wandering down there. And die. Very possibly. Click the townies list and just go check on her. That remains is still there. Because you can see um, where she is. The rogue is clearing that room out. He might clear that out yeah. for us, but we're still going to have to get in there and get that. Let's watch this rogue, because if he can clear that out, we can get the other order in for a grave straight away and get that sorted. I'm more worried Jasmine might just run down here. But it's clear. It's clear down there. But she, she runs down for that bone that's inside the room, yeah. filled with mobsters. I can't... <laughs> mobsters. I can't see doing that, because the task was given for that specific bone. This one didn't exist, so she is tied to that bone. Are you questioning town's logic, Sharon? No, no. ha ha ha! That's definitely how it works. Just find a single skeleton and put it in there. It doesn't Can matter it if it was there before. Thomas has pretty much cleared Jory. this out now. That Thomas. He's so pro. There's only one spider left. Come on. No, Thomas. No. No, Thomas. Stop oh. digging about Thomas. Thomas is digging with the leg winger. Let's, um... What's he doing? Oh, it's no. Okay. He's, comes... he's going for it. Wait. Right. Should... Let's, get that. Let's get that in a grave as well before um, yep. anything else spawns down there. I don't think that's worth a fucking moss for me. No, that's just a regular grave for him. It's not it. Uh, shitty elf that came and would, like died within seconds. It's like, why? Why, why yeah, be a that dick like that? Crap. We've got spare space there. There we go. Uh, um, should wow, we look at Jasmine? Eventful, sodding episode that was. Should we look at Jasmine? Shall we? She's, Click the image. She person. just attacked a ghost of past hero. She's got it. Yes, she's, she's got, got it. She's got tear out of there. Mission complete, everyone. Um, so somebody will come and get the other one. Yeah, and that's that's empty as well. It's a dead end. So nice there's nothing. There. Nothing can spawn down there. Except Actually, ghosts and past heroes. I bet that's that shitty elven bow that they all have. Uh, yeah, it will be. Yeah. Oh, but now I think we can open the doors. Oh yeah, we because should be able to know. the only Having thing that. left down here now is these two. We've got a. A healthy thing and a healthy It's just a bit dog. of a shame that we obviously will immediately start collecting those bones, those goblin knights, those hobgoblin knights, and that weapon that's in there. Yeah. So pretty much everything it is going to go down though. there. Oh, Jasmine's got a hell of a walk back with her. Thank <laughs> God we've got hog roast. She's like, it's okay guys, I'll get it. Yeah. Oh God, I didn't realise um, how heavy it was. <laughs> so the other thing we can do as well is like mine out some passageways. If you think about it. To make the collection easier. Do you do want to do that as well? Yeah, you can do. It's a bit weird that Jasmine kind of walked right. down there, right? With a massive stone tomb that's already been built to put the elf in it to carry it back up. Surely it would have been yeah. easier with a go down with a bag, put all the bones in a bag, bring the bag back up, and put it in the tomb. Surely that would be easier. She likes doing things the difficult way. Right, the doors are all unlocked. The only difference that would have made, right, if the town's developers had put that in is when you say put a mossy tomb here, they'd go and put an open mossy tomb there, go get the skeleton bones, put them in, and then shut the tomb. It'd, we need... it'd be like two extra images and that'd go. be it. A snicker eye chest. Wow. You're, you're so fabulous. 
What, what are you doing? Uh, Snickerite chests. I've just got those sorted. Doors are open. Snickerite chests. So people will yeah. Snickerite. We need to start hauling um, that uh, thing that's on that. Yeah, and level. I want to. I want to just sort of improve the pathing. So improve the pathing. Yeah. I well, let's open the through. code up. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Stop being derp. There we go. Let's knock that, it. knock that through for a start. I think if you put right, always turn left Where as the they're fuck pathing. Is Jasmine go oh, there she is. If you put always turn left, right, on the pathing, yeah. they'd be faster than they go now. <laughs> Probably. You just you know very very busy, complicated doing this. Yeah, things. I'm just See so very have, out of it. I've lost the stairs. I can't uh, look on the big map, aren't they on there? There they are. Yeah. Right. So, we could also do with taking that one out for now. Oh, you make uh, it into a small do little the town initial, down here. initial thing. It's taken Jasmine forever to carry this fucking tomb back. How retarded is this? I know, but the problem is, as we get deeper and deeper to like layer 50, imagine a townie running from the very surface down to layer 50 to put someone in a tomb to bring them back up. Yeah. It's like, unfortunately, you're going to have to build a graveyard underground. Yeah. <laughs> An underground graveyard. <laughs> That's not a bad idea. You're going to have to have an underground graveyard. We could, we could expand this out and build another graveyard. In all honesty, here. it feels like every ten layers you should build another underground town. Just have a lot of houses down here. Yeah. And have like people I mean, living down here. whether you can really put... I mean, can you put a grave on stone, really? Doesn't that sort of... Doesn't it require earth to dig into? No. This town's... <laughs> There's no logic. Look at that door, right? That door is standing up yeah. with nothing attached to it, Sharon. Sure. There's no walls or anything attached to it, it and it's just stood there. Stupid. There is no logic in this game. We could probably bury the bodies under coal if we really wanted to. Jasmine is ever. I sort of want to. Want to. I want Jasmine to finish this before we call the episode. Really, uh, she's, she's almost very there. Close. She's getting slower and slower. Tiredness getting to her. Suddenly she starts getting hungry. Well, she's wet herself. She can't go on. She's crawling. The tomb is just strapped to her back. <laughs> please, please, guys. Guys, uh, someone take the It is hands. pretty stupid. She's getting slower and slower <laughs> and slower. Oh, she's starving as well. Turns to eat, turns to sleep. Yeah. yeah. So she's now starving, really unhappy, <sighs> and really tired. Going well. If they, if they didn't make them walk so fucking slowly, the thing is, she's going to die. Oh, yeah. She's probably going to die. And so we're going to have to fucking bury her corpse. And she's going to she's gonna walk the long way around as well. <laughs> Do you remember when Thingy did that? <laughs> what? She's off into the hills to die. <laughs> We've had this before. Yeah. And then they come out of the dungeon and fucking walk completely the wrong direction. I think it's because she's trying to go over to the kitchen. Because right now it's telling her she needs to eat. So but she's thinking, I've got to go over to the kitchen. But also she wants to go to the graveyard. So the path by needs like to split. Uh, she went down there to go chop Where a bird. is she going? She's, really? She's going to walk around now, right? Fighting against her own pathing system between going to the graveyard and getting something to eat. Then by the time she gets over there to eat something, she just dies. Because she's had to fight for her own pathing system. This is idiotic. Okay, one thing I noticed. I didn't realise that uh, Linux... Uh, not Linux, Lua, sorry, has a uh, bin when you're coding. I did not know this. So, like, if you do um, go from here to here as a path and they can't do it, yeah, you can immediately just bin that command and get another one. And it'll just keep going through until it finds what it can do. Where the fuck is she going? She's Seriously, surfing. what is she doing? She's surfing. I have The thing is, is she going to drop this lap? fucking tube and we're still going to have to... Is somebody else going to take the tomb, or is it going to is it going to wipe the tomb if she drops it? Uh, she'll drop the tomb most likely, and it'll just stay there and never be able to be moved. I think she's going to the chickens to die. Oh no, she's walking on the rocks. I think she's going to drown. Maybe she just wants to go to a Venus flytrap and just get eaten. Where is she going? She's going to put the corpse thing in the Venus flytrap. Moss covered tomb. She is literally dying. She's right now just turning into bones. She's probably going to die. There's no way she's going to make oh, yeah. it now. She's doomed. Jasmine's dead. Jasmine's dead, Dev. But why? Why this stupid on, fucking On pathing? the plus side, we can blame Craig Gummersall. <laughs> we would have been How? able. We would have been able to delete that corpse if it wasn't for Craig Gummersall. Well, yeah. True. So now we have to wait for Jasmine to slowly kill herself. She's disappeared. <laughs> Yeah, there she, she is. does that. She's, it's like right that uh, video I sent you the other day of the YouTubes with the Freedom Forces. 
That yeah. game has the exact same padding as this. <laughs> the of things. Go right next to yourself, and they just walk five miles just, away. I can't get over how stupid this is. I think she's off to go sell it to the caravan, and the caravan's like miles away, so she's like, oh. She's walking completely the wrong direction. Maybe she's getting a bush to put a bush on it to make it mossy. Maybe she has to go get moss. <laughs> Maybe she has to go get Maybe moss. Maybe she's getting moss from somewhere. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> no, not no moss. No, just three stones. <laughs> three stone and stick of moss. Wow. Oh. What? You don't think that it's because she can't reach the stone. But why would she start building if she couldn't reach the stone? That wouldn't make sense. Where is she going if she can't reach the stone? Uh, go look at her and see what's just happened. Oh look. my god, what have you done? Where is she? No, she's just... Exploring. <laughs> <laughs> there is no is way... There's no way to even describe what is happening right now. She's literally going to just die. Just like, die, Jasmine. Just fucking die, and then we can sort it out. We can get somebody who isn't a retard to come and bury you. You like Jasmine? She was your favorite. Not anymore, I don't. <laughs> this is fucking beyond stupid, Flarius. <laughs> well, you would play it out. I, <laughs> I have seen some badly coded oh. games in my time, but this, this takes the biscuit. This is... This is fantastic. Yeah, having the best time of your life. Just fucking die. I want to finish the episode. Just die. Near we haven't got time for your for bullshit, Jasmine. Wherever Jasmine is. <laughs> right, let's just fucking kill her. <laughs> <laughs> kill Jasmine. Don't kill Jasmine. Someone comes on and just rings her neck. <laughs> Put her out of the misery. Look, bitch. Fucking <laughs> butcher her and eat her. Oh, God. Bless her. She's had an hard life. Carrying that grave <laughs> for the last two, four, five, even eight hours. It's probably been a few days, actually. She's, She's dead. Oh, there we go. There we go. She's died. Thank fuck. Where is she going? Oh, I don't know. She has left a corpse, though, so we do need to build another fucking grave. Oh, my God. Well, somebody brought the other one up, at least. Um, <laughs> In the time right, that is somebody going to do, do this moss-covered tomb now? It'd be hilarious if someone picked it up and just walked to their death. <laughs> it was like a cursed tomb. Yeah. Everyone who picks it up has to walk until they die. <laughs> oh, no one wants to touch it, it's cursed. There's a creating place item. Yeah. Um, make another grave then for Jasmine. I think she needs a really good lizard tomb. She's been here for so long and she was is such anyone, a valued memory of the community. Is anyone making their way over here? She was such a good person, Jaren. Right, what, the what I'm going to do is I'm going to put in the order for for her grave, um, and then we'll call the episode and leave it there. She was one of the best around. She was one of the fucking most Give idiotic a... around. Did, wait, you said listen to from villagers, and she's been here for ages. That rooster just spawned there, I think. Yeah, it's shitting on those graves. No, she's not having listened to and she can fuck <laughs> off and have a <laughs> shitty grave. <laughs> <laughs> she died due to retardation, but I was really not to, rewarding that. I need to now make a Jasmine tribute. <laughs> just for her walking <laughs> really slow. <laughs> Only <laughs> just do 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 we lost all the Dark Eyes and Jasmine due to her own stupidity. We lost Tia and the new um, shitty elf. There was also... Tia and the new shitty elf. Yeah, we lost Tia. And the new shitty elf. And we gained <laughs> a shitty barbarian who already has got himself a goblin head as a weapon. But we lost the shitty elf. Yeah, we do, lost the shitty elf. Do you remember elf. his name? Um, Arngear. I thought he was just going to say arsehole then. <laughs> do you remember, arsehole, do you remember his name? Arsehole McArseholes. And that, that seems like... Right. Arsey McArsehead. We'll leave it at that. Um, and whilst all that was going on, the Tarnies have done fuck all. So there you go. <laughs> what a great episode. Yeah, so that's the call it there, folks, and we'll see you next time. Bye bye. Bye bye. Get all your belches out. Burp, 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 burp. Ba 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 